What about Thor Sports? Continue the lead with three laps remaining. They're starting this 2019 season with authority, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Three of their trucks up in the top five. Look at this battle. Ross Chastain, I told him to do something cool. He's going three wide. Gilliland in that four truck sits sixth. Chastain challenging. Ross is going to go around the outside. Looks like he's pulling up even with Gilliland. Ross Chastain trying to make the move on the outside. Get around Todd Gilliland. Harrison Burton is right there behind him. And Austin Hill in that blue and white 16 truck inside the top 10 as well. Two laps remaining. This is a great battle. Six, seven, eight, nine. Hill, last week's winner at Daytona, started on the pole today. Back inside the top 10 again. Another strong run. Well, right around the yellow line for Hill. Meanwhile, Kyle Busch coming to the line. One lap remaining. Kyle Busch chasing history. Trying to win in the truck series for the 52nd time. Breaking the tie with Ron Hornaday, the Hall of Famer. And Kyle has about a seven-tenths of a second lead on Johnny Sauter. Kyle Busch coming through turn four. He makes history today. The winningest driver in truck series history is Kyle Busch. Nice. Thank you, boys. Appreciate it. 52 wins. Nobody has done it better in the truck series than Kyle Busch. And he has put his name in a position in the record books that I don't think anyone will ever top. I don't think anyone will ever win more races in the truck series than what Kyle Busch has done. You know, Vince, I was at Lucas Oil Raceway back in about 2001. Kyle Busch was a 16-year-old, made his truck series debut, had a top 10 finish there, and then they determined that you had to be 18 to run in the truck series due to some reasons, and Kyle had to actually step away for a couple years, but when he came back to NASCAR, he came back with a vengeance, and he's won now 195 times over the three major series in NASCAR. 92 Xfinity Series wins, 51-time winner in the Monster Energy Cup Series. Went on quite the smoke show there, didn't he? A special weekend for Kyle. Not only does he become the winningest driver in Truck Series history, but he will make his 500th career cup start tomorrow.